Welcome back guys, today we'll be looking at how to make logos using Canva, okay? So, let me dash first my Canva app so I can show you how to get it done, okay? So, let's wait for it to load, okay? So, this is the um, interface of our Canva application, okay? So, the first thing you have to do is, you go for logo, okay? You can check out the logo section, okay? You can see, you click on logo, okay? After you have done that, you wait for it. Okay, you can see, you can see all the logos preset that you can use for our design. Okay, you can edit any of this logo to your choice and design it to suit your or whatever you plan you plan on design. Okay, if what you're looking for is not here, you can click on um, let's say search of logo. You can see computer logo there are a lot of there are tons of logo preset that you can use okay whatever you're looking for you can search for it and it will appear on your um, um canva application okay so let's um say we are going to create a computer logo okay so let's click on computer logo. okay you can see these are the templates that are available for the computer logo okay so that's it if you want to go, um, build a logo from the scratch you can click on blank okay to design from scratch um, scratch but today we'll be um, selecting a preset okay so we can get it done fast and easy okay so let's search for a preset that we use for our design okay um, which preset are we going to use? Alright, so I think this, this is okay by me, okay? I prefer this, okay? So, let's wait for it to load. Alright, you can see this look good um, template, okay? So, what you have to do is, if you want to edit the text, you click on the text section okay you can highlight it then delete okay you repeat the name you like to use for the text okay which is web um, design okay let's say this is our um, name that we like to use okay for the tagline you can repeat and add um the tagline okay let's say home of skills right um this is the tagline I would like to use for my design, okay? But um, I, I really don't like this um, icon, it's not related to um, our tag, right? So I'm gonna delete this, okay? I can delete this, or um, let me just go ahead and delete. Okay, to delete, you'll be asked if you like to delete the element itself or you like to delete the group, okay? So you click on delete elements, okay? can see I've deleted that okay let me delete this too you know it's it consists of two elements okay so I've successfully deleted that okay so if you like to add your own logo what you have to do is to click on add okay when you click on add you can choose to add any logo of your choice from the selected templates listed above okay you can also search for whatever you like to add okay that's for the templates okay for the elements you can choose to add any elements of your choice okay if you like to add a rectangle shape or christmas um logo or elements okay when you click on it you can add any elements you really like to add okay why for the uploads you can upload your own image that you like to use for your design okay directly from your gallery okay so that's it for today um i'll be uploading let me search for what I would like to upload, okay. Let's say a um, web icon, right? Uh, all right, website icon, okay. Is this loading, okay? Let's select my look that I would like to use for the design. All right, so you can see. Most of the, I believe you can see the free logos, okay? Where, why some are pro? The pro was, is only for the paid um, plan, okay? It's, you can only access it if you're in the soft, um, premium package, okay? You have to pay before you use it. That means you have to subscribe for any of the packages, okay? But there are a lot of free plans that we can pro around it, okay? So, 
um, I'll go ahead and select the one that I need for my design. Okay. All right. So I'll be using this. Okay. I'll be using this so you can readjust the size. Okay. You can resize this image. Okay. All right. You can see. You can see how I'm resizing the size of our image. Okay. So that's how you cover it. It's as simple as that. If you like to change the front of your design, okay, you can click on front to select the front you that you like for your design, okay. There are a lot of free fronts that you can use. They also pro, which is for the paid version, okay. If you like to get the pro, then you have to subscribe for their plan, okay. But there are a lot of free um um presets that you can use for your front okay for your front so that's it but this is okay by me okay so i'll go ahead and select that if you like to change the color you can select any color that you want for your design if you like a blue color but i prefer the white so i'm gonna leave it at the white color okay for the skill you can choose to um you can choose to change the fonts i would like to change the fonts the fonts of the um, this particular section okay so um, let's check this mm, not really that okay. okay let me use regular okay this for the um, mm, I think this is okay okay but let's try and put it okay you can go ahead and put it by um, selecting the food format okay you can pull you can see so you can align this you can align it or position it to be at the center to the left center right whatever but it's okay at the center right so that's for it okay that's for it okay that's for it if you like to space your text you go ahead and do it okay transparency so all you have to do is to look um, look at whatever tons of design if you like designing check it out play around with it then go ahead and design it okay so that's how to create a simple logo okay that's how to create a simple logo using canva very fast and easy okay fast and easy no much deals okay so that's how to go about it if you're when you're done doing your design you can click on the icon here to save it okay when you click on that you be asked to save okay you can save us or you can share it to any of the social media platform that you want to but I'm, i'll go ahead and save us okay you can select mp4 or um, png but i'll go ahead and save this as a png okay so that's it okay you will go ahead and select that as a png okay so that's how to proceed about that okay so if you really love this video please make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you find this video helpful give this video a thumbs up subscribe and comment and tell me what you feel um, about this video okay so that's it see you next time